we're gonna learn how to use all the fingers fully. Now today we're just learning two on the left and one on the right. Stretch it out. There you are. So stretch it out so you have nice a nice C and a nice G. Good. I'm, I'm needing to support both her finger and, and the arm. Uh, see if you can uh, see if you can just pull on the fingers and if if she makes the effort to adjust your arm, right? Because Kriya, what we're asking is that you're you are going to have to tell your elbow to go up because if the elbows are hanging down the floor, then the fingers are going to be all smashed together. Like this, it'll be easy for you. Uh-huh. Alright. So we got we got the fingers in position. The elbows don't have to go up, only if it's not too hard. Good. Bring. Bring. Good. Oh, I love it. You turned it by yourself. And for play, make sure you're doing both hands together. Play on. Play on. on it. Oh, you're on marching already. Marching here we so this is very easy for you. The right hand's super easy. It's just a little extra. We're pushing a little extra because we want to get both sounds. Because remember you were trying out different sounds earlier? That's what we want to get. We want to get to where your hands are doing that all over the piano. You're, you're being very patient. So we're going to go to marching, but this time you'll start marching uh, third group. You're going to do it with both of the both of the hands at the same time. Mm -hmm. Lift your elbow up here. March. March. Keep going. March. Here goes down to the we. That's it. And now for come, show me how you're going to do the left hand twice. Come, come hold. Ah, yes. Perfect. All right. So I'm going to try something for the next line. Mom, let's see if you can take your pencil and put it under the middle finger for the right or left on the left so you're just putting your pencil in and Kriya what you're gonna do is you're gonna hold your finger there and it's gonna give you access so mom won't have to use much of the fingers this is a trick we found a long time ago a really cool trick see what happens ah ah yes check this out okay there's a Pressing it do. Like oh, the, the leftover fingers. That's okay. What okay. we want to do is, right okay. now, what we want to memorize is that the thumb is going to stretch out to hit the G. Okay, so Kriya, this is work for you, where you're going to keep your middle finger out of the way, and your pinky and thumb are going to come and stretch into the right spot. Even if other fingers are pressing, that's we ignore that. What we want to do is make sure the correct ones are definitely going down. And also, when we're done, we need to know where you got your leggings because I have to see if they have it in my size. <laughs> that is exactly the clothes I wear every day. Because I think I think we have a lot in common, you and I. Yeah. Yeah. That is really snazzy. Yeah. This time, I'm not gonna hold your Keep left. 
Yeah, yeah because mo mom can stay on the elbow and then she can lift your hand up so that you have that kind of support. Uh-huh. So your job is to keep the finger, keep the pencil there. And let's see what happens. Look how beautifully it's working. Stretch, it. Stretch this hand. Stretch the first two, the first and the last. Uh huh. Don't worry about the leftover fingers. That was beautiful. Okay. Okay, we're on the next line. We're on Willie wears his Highland bonnet. Okay. Just keep it there, ignore it, pretend it's not there. Will wears his beautiful. Now what happens for high? Let's see if you can pick up both hands. She just wants to keep playing the right. She keeps because going. it's easy, because it's easy, I know. I know it's super easy. How about we challenge we challenge your hands with one layer of complication? Why not? I'm not trying to torture you. I just want to push you to the next level. Okay, but look how beautifully it stayed. You see how it stayed? Now we're going to get it up and down for Highland Bonnet. your glasses on all right you got to fix the glasses do you want it on your nose or over your nose or on your mouth where do you want it there is a clear one side nose or head or you want to take it off or on eyeglass on or off eh? what do you mean what do you want to do with your eyeglass take it oh <coughs> f off okay i'll take it off Come. all right <coughs> yeah, it fell down and I don't think you wanted that. Okay, so we're on Johnny Beats the Drum. You did Willie wears his Highland bonnet. For Johnny, look, I want you to appreciate appreciate how your fingers are sitting there. So mom, can we try left both hands elbows? No pencil, just elbows. Okay? Like this? Yep. Yeah. Priya, don't don't worry if it doesn't go perfect on the left side. Uh huh. See, mom, the elbows are really a magic trick. Okay. Okay, so now we're on Johnny. John, start with Johnny on the D. John. Uh huh. So you, mom's on the elbow, so your job is to find the finger. John. Uh huh. All right. Uh, beautiful. Now we're coming back to drum for the last group. Yeah. Second line, the end of the second line. This hand. Stretch. Stretch your fingers, Anna. Uh huh. Stretch. Beautiful. <laughs> So this is something that I learned and Luke, I learned this from my student, Luke. He's, he said to me using his letter board, he spelled for me. He said that when his two hands have to work together, he, he loses information on where his body is. And then he ends up bending down and sometimes he's even licking the keys. Okay. So we found that as soon as he's just playing one hand, his body sits upright. When we go down with the two hands, the, the, the head starts falling also. This is why I ask mom to hold the elbows because when she holds the elbow, she gives information for the shoulder and the neck on where to stay. Okay? So I, I'm, I want you to notice the changes in your body when you're asking the body to do more complicated things. And then I'm going to work with you to fix that. One of the best tricks we found is to... I'll get her. She yes. Has I want to try if you can sit with one foot up on the piano. This is going to keep your body in center. I know it's kind of weird, 
Let's see if you can put one foot up. So it doesn't matter right or left which leg you want to pick up. It's going to stabilize your body core. All right. There you go. And you're kind of going to lean your whole body onto it. You can even put your chin on. Put your chin on your knee. Uh -huh. Look, 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 look at the difference. Look how cool this is. And now the body's bending forward, right? What you want to do is you want to wrap your two hands around your knees so you can stay centered. Okay? Let's try that for, uh, for the third line. We're on the third line. We're going to try it with your knee up for Caroline. Caroline commands the party. Just to see if this helps Priya's body stay more organized. Yeah, like that. You can rest your chin here if you want. And you can hold your elbow. Yeah, stretch your... It's already, it already looks so much more comfortable. We are on this line, KK, okay? Okay, so Caroline. Good. Yeah. Beautiful. Keep 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 going. Yeah. Ignore the left hand. Yeah. Keep going. Good. Line. Good. And then come back. Caroline. What happens next? Over here. You don't want that position? Let's give it one more try and then if you don't like it, you can put it back up. It, the position was interesting because it got your hands moving very, very quickly. Can we try that once more, Priya? You can change to the left foot if you want. Yeah. Let's try this feet. Okay, I'll help you. Let this feet comes up like this. What it does is it helps the elbow go up. It's helping your elbow stay in position, okay? So then when mom is holding, she doesn't have to also move your hands. Caroline. Man's party. Beautiful. Mikey, go to Mikey. Uh-huh, good, good, good. My. Uh -huh, keep going. Left finger. Lead. Good. Good turning. The nice skipping. And now you're on rear. Both hands together, Anna, for the last one. Rear. And another one. Boom. Cool. All right. We're on the last line, my friend. I think we should keep trying with the leg. How about we change? If you want left or right, it's your choice. This is a temporary tool. You will not be playing piano with your leg up for the rest of your life. I promise. Which one? Right We're using leg. all the tools you have in your body. Right leg or left leg? Left. All right. We're going to left. Oh, good. All right. Look how straight your elbow is happening. This is so cool. All right. Feet, feet start on the G. Beautiful, nice and locked in. Keep going. Lurkin party. This is the end. Wow, it's right there. Good, good, good. Nice trip. Finish it. Beautiful. So you do have tools and you do have ways for using your body to get stronger and stronger.